Continuing our team coverage now of a train derailment in Cimarron, Kansas. More than 30 people were taken to the hospital. We know the two are still in the hospital, but others are now stuck trying to find their way to their destinations. Amtrak is using buses to get them where they need to be. But uh, let's check in with 41 Action News reporter Sarah Plake at Union Station. Sarah? Yeah, that's right, Cynthia. Amtrak is char chartering buses for those folks that did not go to the hospital. Uh, as last time I checked and last time I got an update, they are still staying at the 4-H Rec Center in Cimarron. So whenever they're going to depart, we don't know, but it is a five-hour trip. Of course, those are the people that were on that train, de that train that derailed earlier this morning that actually affected folks here in Kansas City. These seven destinations that you see on this sign here, uh, those are uh, canceled, of course, because that train obviously could not come. A lot of other people's travel plans are up in the air. Like I said, folks showed up to Union Station this morning expecting to board that Southwest Chief Train 4 at 745. They had no idea about the cancellation or derailment until we told them or until they waited in line for the ticket booth. Now many are having to reschedule and scramble to change their plans and a lot of folks I talked to said Amtrak could have notified them sooner. We're going to take the train into St. Louis, hopefully make our train to New York. If not, we'll worry about that when we get to Chicago and see what we want to do. And this is a developing story. As long as we get those inf the information, we'll get that to you. Make sure you c continue to check our Twitter page and KSHB.com for all the updates throughout the day. Live at Union Station, Sarah Plake, 41 Action News.